Hi guys! Welcome back to my YouTube channel. So for today, we're gonna answer a question raised or asked by one of our subscribers, specifically our subscribers from India. So he just wanted to know uh, the approach on the given problem regarding Laplace transformation. So this is the problem from our Indian subscribers. So find the inverse Laplace transform of 1 over square root of 2 multiplied by s plus 3. So let us first recall that the Laplace transformation, so this is or the Laplace transform of e raised to a t can be written as 1 over s minus a. Okay? So as you can see, the problem I think that he encountered is that there is a coefficient on the s term. So we have a square root of 2. So the idea here is we have to eliminate first square root of 2 without affecting the whole expression. So since there is a square root of 2 here, what we need what we need to do is divide both numerator and denominator by square root of 2. So what we will do is 1 over square root of 2. So we divide the numerator by square root of 2. And we also divide the denominator by square root of 2. Okay, so that will still be the same because we divided the numerator by square root of 2. So we must do it as well in the denominator so that the given expression won't change. Okay, next. So we can simplify this as 1 over square root of 2. So if we rationalize the denominator, so this is also equivalent to square root of 2 over 2 all over square root of 2 over square root of 2. So that will be s plus 3 over square root of 2. And if we simplify this one by rationalizing the denominator, so we will come up with square root of 2 over 2 all over s plus 3 square root of 2 over 2. Okay? So, but we recall the concept that the Laplace transform of e raised to a t is equivalent to 1 over s minus a. So this is plus, so we can rewrite this as uh, s plus, so we can rewrite this as s minus of the negative of this one. So applying this concept, it follows that the inverse Laplace transform of, of this one must be equal to, so there is a constant here, so that must be a multiplier. So that is square root of 2 over 2 e raised to a. What is our a here? What is uh, our a here? So our a will be negative 3 square root of 2 over 2. So we will just write it in the exponent part and then just multiply it by t. Therefore, the inverse Laplace transform of 1 over square root of 2 s plus 3 will be this expression. Okay, I'll just have a recap. So, recap of the concept and then divide both the numerator and denominator by square root of 2 so that we can come up with an S expression only in the given denominator. So, it became S plus 3 over square root of 2 and then once we simplify this, it will become S minus negative 3 square root of 2 over 2 because we want in this form, right? So, we want same form and then the numerator here will just be the multiplier. So, the inverse Laplace transform is equal to square root of 2 over 2 e raised to negative 3 square root of 2 over 2 multiplied by t. So that is how we get it. So if, we, if in case you have questions or clarifications, don't forget to comment on the comment section. Thank you so much to all my uh, avid subscribers and supporters, especially watching my math YouTube videos and keep safe guys especially this is still uh, we are still in pandemic stage so please also subscribe to my mother's channel so that is Mary Ann Maling her uh, her channel name and it is more on cooking in terms of her blog so uh, see you on my next math tutorial videos and I hope you will learn a lot more from the for the next videos and from my previous videos and have a nice day bye